What's up, guys? Welcome back to The Save Show. This will be a weekly or bi-weekly update of my life as I seek to become a better man, husband, and father, and most importantly, a follower of Jesus Christ. So we're going to get into everything as it relates to lifestyle, as it relates to scripture, as it relates to fitness. You're going to get to watch me through weekly updates struggle, (laughs) to put it plainly. Uh, Case in point, this episode is coming out to you on Veterans Day, which is Friday. Thank you all who have served. Um, Not thanking myself, but uh, everybody else out there. Thank you for your service. It's not nothing. Don't forget that. It's no small thing. That said, it is Friday. Uh, Episodes normally come out on Sunday, which means I record them usually the week prior, likely on Saturday during nap time. It didn't happen. We had our first Thanksgiving uh, celebration last weekend, and honestly, this week was just a blur. Uh, too busy uh, with other things, getting stuff set up um, in regards to the show, uh, in regards to a collaborative post for Veterans Day, um, in regards to the store. Um, got some new stuff dropping. I let a little bit of a teaser out earlier this week. Uh, everything should be dropping. You're hearing it here first. Should be tomorrow. We'll get it up and running. A um, couple of exciting designs that I'm really excited for. Um, yeah, so it's supposed to be a weekly show. Sometimes we're just going to miss the mark. So I'm struggling. And you get to watch it all right here. Veterans Day. Um, like I said, it's not nothing. If you are a veteran, if you're hearing this, thank you, truly. Um, I look back on my years fondly. I know it's not the the best when you're in it, um, and I certainly have some questions about my service and and what it all means. What was what was the point? But I do have some some great moments that I think back to fondly, and I definitely have great relationships. So if you're out there struggling, you don't know how to cope, um, just reach out. I'll give you a call. Um, want to make sure you're you're doing okay. For today, go out and grab some free Chick Fil A or whatever's out there. It's not really my thing, but have fun with it. Enjoy celebrating. Uh, I have the work day off, which I'm very thankful for that my company does that. Um, yeah, I hope it's a good Veterans Day for you. In regards to the new stuff coming to the store, we have some exciting new uh, designs. One that I'm particularly excited for, it's this uh, design that I've had in my head for years now. It's what I want to have tattooed, um, likely on my forearm uh, or, you know, my back. I could get it bigger in in that regard or my thigh uh, or calf muscle. Anyways, this is a tattoo that I've wanted to get, um, made a nice design, uh, good looking, sleek design. Uh, It's going to look great on you as you get uh, the t-shirt or sweatshirt that it's on. I'm excited for you to see it. It's uh, my tagline, not eager, forever willing, with a cross and the verse John 15, 13. Greater love hath no man than this, that he lay down his life for his friends. So check it out. That one's coming out, uh, like I said, hoping hoping for tomorrow. I want to make sure people can get stuff by the holidays. Uh, It's the Christmas collection. Uh, if you want to think about it in that regard. So we've got uh, the Silent Night shirt, uh, this Not Eager, Forever Willing shirt, um, among some other really cool designs. Uh, not Eager, Forever Willing. I've talked about it before, but uh, I've got a few more minutes. Just going to be a quick update today, and I'll hit publish. Um, not Eager, Forever Willing. Christ was in the garden the night before he was crucified. Um, we learn that he was stressed Um, He was weeping blood, which only happens in extreme um, fight-or-flight type of moments for the body. He's extremely stressed, anxiety to the max, doesn't necessarily desire or want or have any eagerness for the next day and what's coming. However, he was willing to do it. He died for all of us um, and extended his grace to, uh, to take care of our debts. So that's kind of the uh, scripture reason for the the saying, not eager, forever willing, um, just as Christ um, did. Hopefully we can mirror him as, uh, as Christians. When it comes to our veterans, you guys certainly, you know, I guess I'm lumping myself in there. You guys certainly embody that, that thought. 
nobody w wants to go out there and die in you know the desert in the Middle East, for example, for contemporary veterans. Um, but by stepping on the line, stepping on those uh, yellow footprints, holding up your arm, your hand, rather, swearing an oath to protect the country, uh, you were willing to do that. Like I said, you're not eager. You're not going to um, rush into anything guns blazing unless the moment calls for it. But you were willing to go and do um, above and beyond what some of your your uh, fellow countrymen were willing to do. So um, wear the shirt with pride. Wear it out and about. Um, you know, I can, I'm going to try to make the product description something that, that you can say as you're out and about and somebody says they like your shirt. Oh, hey, let me uh, tell you the reasoning reasoning behind it. Um, I'm really excited to one day have that slapped on me um, as the world, maybe the culture. Anyways, as the tides are turning in our country, I want people to be able to just easily identify who I'm following, what I'm doing here on this earth, and they can hate me for it or, or uh, join in. So I want that to be a permanent part of me. Um, what's on the outside should reflect what's on the inside. Um, so I'm hoping to have everything set up tomorrow. Check it out. I'll uh, maybe set up a reminder on Instagram, stuff like that. Uh, I'll get it up on the website. It'll be the Christmas collection, like I said. Um, I just placed a sample order myself. It says it's going to ship in about a week. So, um, you know, I think it next week it'll be five weeks until Christmas. So you want something, get a gift for your loved ones. Plenty of time. Like I said, I wanted to make sure that that, that happened. So I've been working this week to make sure everything's lined up. Got, you know, the mock-ups, the designs are on shirts. Um, I did a, a wealth of different um, products. If there is a design that's on something like a t-shirt, but you would rather see it on a sweatshirt, um, just message me on Instagram or, or email, uh, the save show at gmail.com. Um, happy to, to make that happen, whatever I can do to, to get these designs out to you. Um, I think I've said it before. The store isn't meant to replace my income or, or offer any monetary gain. What I think, um, I am doing this is, is more of an instrument, um, some of these designs came to me when I was at communion, you know, um, the last uh, couple of months. Um, so I put them into effect. Um, everything's priced, like I said, not for my monetary gain, but if we can get these designs out there and start conversations with people and, and save um, people, not through anything that we do, of course, but having the conversation, let, letting God work in people's lives, then let's do that. Um, let's get it out there and make it happen. <laughs> Uh, with that, the laptop's about to die. I got to take my wife on a lunch date because we're very blessed. Um, we got grandparents watching the kiddos today. Um, yeah, hope you guys are doing well today. This is going to drop on Veterans Day, so happy Veterans Day to you. Uh, hoping to get another episode out on Sunday. Back to regular programming. I've got tons of ideas. People message me some things that they'd like to hear, so I might cover some of that. Um, Hot take today, we're, we'll skip it, we'll let everybody go about their day, um, quick 10 minute episode with Justin, but this has been The Save Show, go check out thesave.store over the weekend, thank you veterans for your service, thank um, moms, dads, brothers, wives, sisters, family, friends, everyone who's supporting the veterans uh, as they served or after they get out of the military, thank you as well, um, it's no small feat for anyone um, to have that kind of life, so thank you. God bless you. God loves us, each and every one of us. And please remember that you are saved.